Nothing is more disturbing than God's will when it comes to illnesses and near-death experiences. We have an extreme large amount of people that want to have God's involvement into these situations. I have a brother who is a born-again Christian. He almost died of renal failure because his kidneys were almost completely destroyed. But he's better now. He's got the operations and all that. Looks like, hey, everything's going to be fine for him. I'm happy for him on that aspect. But he became born again. It is people like this that will say, God saved me. God didn't do anything. It's those doctors that did everything. They're the ones that put in the proper medications, who supervised you, looked after you for how many months. They are the people that did the research to find you that replacement kidney and or other organs. God didn't do anything. And I know what's going to happen. It, God was just testing me. Don't you just hate God's tests? I mean, I hear this all the time and it just makes me sick. People will proclaim that God doesn't give you more than you can handle. This is a test of strength. It's going to make you a better person at the end. But you wait, wait. But when the person dies, oh, that was God's will. God's just welcomed them back. So they got their bases covered either way it goes. Even if you live or if you die, it, it's all part of God's master plan. A year and a half ago, a little girl in Wisconsin died of diabetes. She went into a diabetic shock and her body shut down. Her parents were these extreme Christians that were going to let prayer heal their daughter. She died of diabetes when she didn't have to. Even in the last day of her life, the doctors said they could have saved her. They had the equipment. These people were so blinded by their religion that they let their daughter die. This is absolutely disgusting. God's will is bullshit. You are a parent first. Think of your children first. This to me is more proof that this that your God concept is not real. You have no God. The Bible says ask for anything. Ask God to do something. Put a time limit on it. I oh, you know you're not supposed to test God. It's all part of God's will. Then why do you pray in the first place? Is it's God's will, it's part of God's plan. When you pray, you're asking God to change his plan. Hmm. Bet you didn't think of that. But anyway, you cannot let your religion interfere with medicinal actions. Okay? If there is a way to save a life, save the life. God's not going to do it. Your God is not real. Come on, people. Enough young children have died and suffered because of your God. It needs to stop now.